We often think that great artists will just grab a canvas and some paint and go to work on their art, but usually beforehand they spend a lot of time uh, thinking about what is going to be in their painting and practicing different aspects of that painting. With Andrew Wyeth, he often um, spent a lot of time deciding what was going to go in a painting and more importantly what was not going to go into a painting, as we'll see with this example with his painting called Groundhog's Day. So his first idea was to have a open window in a house with a woman sitting in front of it. But eventually he decides to add a dog on the lower left. So he pursues that idea and practices sketching the dog. He does several artworks, uh, getting the detail of the dog just right. But then he starts thinking, Maybe instead of a dog and a woman, it'll be a table with a cup. Or maybe bread and a plate and a cup on the table instead. Then he focuses on what he's going to put on the wall. Should he try to imitate the wallpaper that's on that wall? He also thinks about what's going to be in the window. Maybe a chopped log. We can see there on the bottom, the dog returns for a moment. He spends some time with watercolor and pencil practicing the log. And here's his final results. After maybe dozens of sketches, we see there's a plate, a cup, and a knife. No bread, no dog, no woman. We have the wallpaper and the log have both made it to the final print.